Hey, what's going on guys? Lost with Custom Offsets. Today's video, we got another episode of this or that for you guys. Today, I brought Biggs along and we're gonna answer those questions for you guys. Now, before we hop into it, if you guys need wheels, tires, suspension, accessories, customoffsets.com, we're also doing another giveaway. You guys can find all the information out at customoffsets.com forward slash giveaway. Boom. That was good. Solid axle swap Tacoma or second gen Dodge 1500? Really weird question. It's a very weird question. They have no relevance whatsoever. No. Like to, to each other. Yeah, yeah, not to each other, but both very unique. <laughs> very interesting. Solid axle swap a Tacoma, not a Tundra. I'm doing that. That'd be sick. Yeah, I'd probably do that as well. Yeah, I always like I seeing I always like seeing like a ton of people who like custom like solid axle swap, you know, things that aren't normally solid axle trucks. And it's a lot of work, but it always turns out super killer and it always looks super good, so. Yeah, I'm probably gonna go that route as well, just cause I'm not a huge fan of a 1500, especially, was it second gen? Second gen Dodge. Yeah, 1500, not a huge fan, so. You have a 1500. No, I don't. Well, you have a half ton. Yeah, I have an F-150, but I don't like yeah, the second, so I don't yeah. like the second gen Dodge. Okay. I don't like the whole one. All right, fair enough. I'm just playing devil's advocate, you know? Fair enough. Fair, fair enough. enough. Fair enough. Are we ready? Lifted Ram SRT-10 or slammed Ram TRX? <laughs> what in the hell? <laughs> what are these questions? Who picked these? What the hell? I would take both, but flipped. Opposite. Leave them how they're supposed to be. Yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna go slam TRX. God, dude, why are you picking this? That's what I do. Because we're the well. same people. That man's an imposter. That man is the imposter. Slam, slam TRX. Just because those TRXs already come like stacked from the factory, still have a ton of power, and like to see that thing down on the ground, it'd turn be, into some sort of street truck. It'd be cool. Yeah. I mean, their suspension out of the factory is good, though. Yeah. And then you're literally taking all that out. Yeah, you sell this the, the factory suspension for your air kit. Fair enough. I think it would be cool. I mean, no one, I doubt that anyone has done that yet or is planning on doing it. Yeah. Do it. Mm -hmm. Do it. I don't know. That's These questions are very odd. We're off to a good start today. Yeah. Ram 1500 or Chevy Silverado 1500? Well, I just answered that I don't like the Ram 1500, so I'm gonna go with the Silverado, or the Chevy 1500, because it's better of, I mean, it's, yeah. it's better of, I, unless I don't it's, know. unless. Today, Junior! Fifth gen Ram 1500, compared to a Chevy 1500, or like a newer Chevy 1500, I'd pick That's the Ram. Fair. That's fair. But like if we're, you know, same aspect, second gen compared to, the, dude, those, both of those body styles were not favorable. Yeah. The, like I'd probably generation. go Chevy just because I have one. Like you said, I think the only way that I would choose maybe Ram over the Chevy would be if I were to take a fifth gen. But yeah. past that, I think all, I think Chevy's always killed it. Right. So I've always just been a fan of Chevy trucks. Yeah, if it's the fifth gen, I'll take the fifth gen. But if it's anything other than the fifth gen, I'm taking the, the 15 or the Chevy 1500. You already said that. Yeah. Next. Next question. Leveled on forces or 12 inch lift with military tires? Leveled on forces. 12 inch lift with military tires. Let them fight. Leveled on forces. 100%. I mean, it looks good, but look at Gabe. Military tires, the thing's massive. 12 inch lift. Yeah, and I previously stated on multiple this or that's and even FTGs, like with trucks of this style, I'm really liking the leveled look with the stanced out, you know, yeah. you know, wide wheel setup, especially the fifth gens. Yeah. They look hot with that. Or Absolutely. even or even a platy. With I just that. I just like having huge truck is just the game that I'm in right now that I yeah. really enjoy. So I'd have to go with the, the big truck on military tires to be sick. I've also never owned a huge truck on, you know, stock height right now. So that's what I'm used to. <laughs> Completely built gladiator or built Tacoma? Oh, now this is a good question. Gladiator. 
Tacoma. Why? I like built Tacoma. Like you don't like gladiators. I like gladiators, but I kind of like that show build Tacoma. I don't know. It's just cool to me. It's different. It's like a. It's like if you built a ranger. Like, even the huge gladiators. Not only do they look showy, but you can also take them off road. Like You're such a bro The one, the one that Archon shot with the. 40s oh, yeah. and the American flag yeah, wraps, like hot. the thing was insane. And it could pull off the show look at a show, but it could also take the trails and go overlanding and stuff. Right. And personally, I, I've i been in the market, you know, my girlfriend and I have been looking at gliders for oh, quite a while, just as a daily. Right. Um, and I I think it'd be sick. I mean, you can damn near stuff 40s, like without even yeah. messing with the suspension at all. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I mean, they're both Tacomas equally, are sick though. They're both equally yeah. a cool build either way. Yeah. But definitely multifunctional I'd go with the gladiator, I think. Yeah. Would you rather have your dream car or your dream truck? Which and why? Dream truck. It's custom offsets, baby. That is the dumbest question I've ever heard. Of course it's I mean I guess. Like even mm. truck guys have dream cars, so like it's not fully Fair enough, but this is custom offsets, like you said. This is a truck channel. Yeah. We don't get down with no cars. Yeah. We envision a truck build. We don't envision a car build. Right. So what are you taking? Dream truck and why? Dream truck. 97 OBS F350 7.3. Damn. Damn! Why? Um. Dude, why did you have to ask that? <laughs> why? That's part of the question. That is we part of the question. That. that is part of the question. Uh, I don't know because everyone's getting down with new trucks and I am not from that age. And I don't know. I just really, really like that body style. Um, definitely the like crew cab long bed ones. Yeah. Like just they're stretched out, just huge. And like right. when you put a big setup on them, I don't know. They just, they just look insane. Yeah. For me, I'd probably say, and the channel already knows, 2017. 17 plus F250. Um, yep. I can pretty much get down with literally every body style truck ever made, oh. other than like, you know, there's your F here and there that, that I don't really get down with. But for the most part, I love every single body style. And it's still like the 17 Super Duty is what, like I've always been like, yeah, I want this and I want that and I want this and I want that. And just like everyone, you know, yep. it's like kid in the candy store. But at the end of the day, I still to this day find myself at least once a week opening up car gurus, looking for F-250s that are 17 plus everywhere across the country because that's literally what I want. So I would have to go with that. I think, I think that covers what and why because I just, I'm still seeking one. Would you rather live one life that lasts 1,000 years or live 10 lives that last 100 years each? One life, 1,000 years, or 10 lives, 100 years? Numbers. I'd say 10 lives, 100 years each. Yeah. I just feel like when you live your one life, you kind of get in the same mindset about things and like to live that same way for a thousand years That'd would be, be rough. Like, yeah, Unless you, you're 100% successful. Yeah, you just... like you could change a lot of stuff obviously. Like you could change careers, you could change all this stuff. But like, I would like to try different lifestyles, different obtainable items, different right. relationships, friendships, all that stuff. You'd, you'd have so many options over 10 different personality and lives. Compared to one. Yeah, and I mean, one. yeah, for sure. And then, like, what if you could build off that? So, like, oh, I didn't like what I did here. It's almost like, you know, trial and error. Yeah, it's almost like painting that perfect picture of, oh, shit, this relationship didn't yeah. work out. Let's totally avoid that. And where would I be at? And like this life. But by your ten, tenth life, you better have that figured out. Yeah, or... if you don't, then I'm sorry. We yeah. can't help you there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, that's what we got for you guys on today's episode of This or That. If, once again, if you guys need wheels, tires, suspension, accessories, custom offsets.com. We'll see you guys in the next one.